What's your healthiest meal? What? What's, do you have any health meals? Anything that's fresh? No, we don't. The culture in America is that everything revolves around food and unhealthy food. The health care cost trajectory is out of control because the consumers are not in charge. This is clearly an unsustainable trend. We're not telling people how to use food. Red meat, Beef. green beans with bacon and butter. When we talk about this idea of plant-based nutrition. It's a powerful concept, and it's one that my father is associated with. Dr. Colin Campbell, doc. Whole foods, plants-based diet. Right. You don't mean the store. You know, I went on essentially a plant-based diet. No dairy, no meat. Type 2 diabetes, heart disease, hypertension. Gone. Physicians don't know how to prescribe a diet. We've been taught how to write prescriptions. Right now, this information isn't available to them. So how can they make a decision? We're working our way into the political process here. The absence of meat as part of your diet is not the best direction for all Kentuckians. you got to realize that there's a lot of big money interest. But the amendment itself is flat out true. We're trying to demonstrate this concept in this community. We offered 10 days of food. I've been testing for 26 years, and I've never seen results like this. Mr. Speaker, I call for a vote. The folks that are challenging this, they represent big business. Well, the truth is a stubborn thing. And it doesn't go away. The documentary Plant Pure Nation explores scientific evidence. In any movement, the first step is always the hardest. Your total cholesterol is 150. Is that accurate? Yep. When people learn about this, the very next question they ask, why haven't I heard this before? Why? Because revolutions can't start without awareness. Back when I started this, there were three farmers markets, now there's about 26. The amount of money that we spend to create the kind of health situation we have, it's not working. This is going to be a lifestyle. Our thesis is that we've got to change this world from the bottom up.